right, what is up everybody? Uh, welcome to Independence Guitar. I hope everybody's having a great day as I am. Why am I having such a great day? Because it is New Guitar Day. Um, and I'm going to share the unboxing with you. So without further ado, let's get started. <clears throat> What I have in here is a brand new Jackson. What kind? Let's find out. First off, uh, as with any other unboxing, you must get the uh, biggest knife in the house. Uh, well, maybe this is a bit overkill. So, uh, uh, yeah, I'll just try this Already cheated a little bit. I took that out of the uh, the big box, so it's just the small box. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, my God. What is this? Oh. So, I don't know if Jackson sent me this with the guitar or if this just comes with it regularly, but it's a, uh, a strap lock system. It is a... An original, oh, it's an original strap lock trademark. Nice. Jackson Fender present free online lessons at Play Fender, Fender Play Fender Playlist PlayFender.com. That's yeah. And this is oh, hold on. I I got I gotta get the styrofoam off. Tada! What this is, ladies and gentlemen, is a Jackson Pro Series DK2 FR7. DK2 meaning the second generation dinky, FR7 meaning original USA made. Floyd Rose even says it right here on the, on the top, and oh man, is this beautiful. Um, seven string locking nut, and uh, really cool about this these are fishman fluence open core active pickups and what this does so these are splittable this is a five-way switch so all the way in the front meaning uh, full-on neck pickup uh, next back meaning just this one neck pickup middle in the middle two back and all the way back just bridge pickup and so on. And if I'm not mistaken, this push pull, this push pull pot right here. So this switches, I think, between active and passive voicings. So if you want the heavier tone, it's in. And if you want the more uh, classical type rock and roll tone, pull it out, and that switches it to a different circuit or a passive voicing. Uh, it has lumen lay side dots and I'm gonna say I'm mistaken this is uh, let's see a three-piece maple and uh, I forget 
forget what kind of it's maple and something else the fretboard is ebony this is the first guitar i've ever owned with an ebony fretboard i always i always get maple and rosewood but uh, i had to i had to try one time with, with ebony Beautiful. The body is made of ash, and it's uh, it's fairly lightweight. It's fairly lightweight compared to uh, my mahogany. I want to see if it's in tune. Nope. <laughs> okay. And then here we should have. A whammy bar. Yes, and then here is the whammy bar. Uh, Allen wrenches. And uh, it looks like an extra spring for maybe the uh, Floyd Rose mechanism. I'm not really sure. Gonna have to find out. This is also my first guitar that I've ever had that's had a Floyd Rose or tremolo system, really, for that matter. And man, does this thing look fancy. in Korea. Wow. Okay, well, I am going to get her tuned up, figure out how to get her tuned up first. But uh, stick around in just a moment and we'll see what she sounds like. All right, I got her all tuned up and ready to go. Uh, figured out how to use a Floyd Rose. It turns out it's not that hard. Uh, by the way, uh, I learned from uh, Ben Eller's YouTube channel. Uh, if you are wondering at all how Floyd Rose works or want some good tips on how to get it tuned up a lot easier, uh, he's got some good videos on it. Uh, without, further, without further ado, uh, let's give it a sound test.
thanks for watching. This is my brand new DK FR7 Pro Series Jackson. Uh, I'm looking forward to using it in upcoming videos. Uh, please go and check out my band on Facebook, The Herd Offensive. Um, and please comment below, like, subscribe, let me know what kind of uh, material that you guys want to see. Thank you very much.